Thank you. Uh, we're going to play one more new song, then we'll go back to old songs. Then we'll play a couple more new songs later on. Not another day, I mean like later on in the set, but uh... uh okay, this one... This one doesn't have a religious title, it's called The Cure. <laughs> healing. It is very healing, you're right. Um, I'm not going to get into it. But it's, uh, I don't know what's happening right now. <laughs> I just, I remember I'm at a show, so I'm going to play this song. I wrote this song a really long time ago, and uh, it feels weird to play it, but does, is anyone here from Vancouver? That's amazing. It's weird. I think that person rides my bus in the um, I wrote this, this song and the first one that we played, Hell, about uh, the downtown east side, uh, which is like a neighborhood in Vancouver, which some of you may or may not have visited at some point or live in. I lived in it. Uh, I was still, I was writing songs, um, and I felt like maybe it was getting a bit redundant to write about love. I had a moment of insecurity, and I thought, what happens in a musician's career when they stop writing about love? They get all political. So I was like, I live in the downtown east side. It's a, you know, a really interesting, really sad neighborhood, but there's some really, you know, crazy stuff happening there. And uh, when I first moved there, I thought, you know. Why can't they fix the problems here? I'm gonna fix them. You know, I'm gonna move there and I don't go off oh, because it was over instantly. I moved into the neighborhood and I was like, oh. <laughs> you know, like it's just so easy to become apathetic. But, um, but uh, I, yeah, I had a moment where I was like, I'm gonna write about the neighborhood. And when I first moved into a neighborhood, there was an article on the cover of the Vancouver province, I think it was, and it had an aerial photo of my neighborhood, and it was like Vancouver's eight blocks of hell. It up on the wall. <laughs> anyway, so I wrote these songs about the neighborhood, but they're really just like metaphors for love. And um, <laughs> so this is gonna be kind of like a game, you know, when you listen to the song, try to find the. I don't know what I'm saying. I just now I'm thinking about Sudoku. Just pop your head. I just learned how to play Sudoku. Play it. I don't know. Do it. How do you say do it? Play or do? I just learned how to do Sudoku. Solve Sudoku. Solve Sudoku. 